Tony! Alan! What are you doing here? Alan? Well, you know, Tony works in a clinic just a few blocks from here, and I needed some medical advice, so I decided... Alan to... lives here. You had no right to tell her that. Why don't we discuss it inside? Come on. Come on, Alan. Let me show you. Come, come inside. <laughs> come on in. I'm doing some research in the neighborhood. Research? About what? She's a private investigator, Alan, remember? Since I'm only here a couple of hours a day, it's really important that I keep my identity a secret. Well, not that I would speak to anyone in this cesspool, but your secret is safe with me. It's funny, I always thought a stakeout, you know, you, you'd have like machine guns stacked in the corner or something. No, no, nothing that serious. I'm just keeping my eye on a couple of people. Oh, really? Anybody I know? Maybe I can help. Oh, no, 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 no. I, I prefer to honor the private and private investigator. Alan, you never agreed to keep my identity a secret. Oh, you don't have to worry about me, Felicia. I will be the soul of discretion. A death mask. How appropriate. I trust there's no chance Spencer can trace the safe break-in back to you. I made sure it looked like a robbery. No one will suspect that the mask was the real target. Good. Now we need a witness. To what? As you may recall, this letter opener was removed from my desk and used to loosen the parapet railing. It was replaced, complete with traces of mortar dust. The police found it and arrested me for my fiancé's murder. And you think that Spencer used it himself and then planted it back in your desk? I'm certain of it. Look, I don't know Spencer, but from what I've heard, he's too crafty to have let anyone see him do it. But if we can find someone who saw him entering or leaving this room wearing that mask, the evidence could be sufficiently incriminating. What if he used the tunnel entrance? The tunnel entrance to this room was locked that evening. The house was overflowing with guests. Many of them spilled out into the hallway right outside that door. Someone should remember that hideous thing. How many guests total? 200. If I question everyone, the buzz will be all around Port Giles in a day. Maybe Spencer hears it, decides he wants to stay underground for good. No, never. There's too much here he wants. Nicholas, hi. hi. Oh, I was just on my way out. I'm glad I didn't miss you. Uh, me too. Uh, oh, you know what? Your sister's right next door. Come on, let's go surprise her. Actually, any, any other day I'd, I'd love to, but uh, there's something important we need to discuss. I, I left you a message last night. You, you, didn't, you didn't get it? No, oh no. Um, have you heard from Lucky since the party last night? What happened? Well, he's, he's missing. What? Lucky, open the door. Come on, you got me. That was a real good maneuver, all right. Score one for Dallas. Hey, it's me, I'm okay. I'm lucky, thank God. What happened? Uh, my dad's back in town. On, he uh, wanted to door. spend some time with me. And let's just say he persuaded me. Are you all right? Yeah, yeah. I'm fine. It's just the same old stuff over again. Oh, Elizabeth, I'm so sorry. I know you must have been scared. Tried terrified. Uh, anyone else know I'm gone? Uh, your Aunt Bobby and the police. You called them? No use. <laughs> What's that noise? Lucky! Open it, that door! Him. He sounds furious. Yeah, well, I'm he's you. having a little trouble adjusting to our situation. You're not fighting with him, are you? No, I don't think that's that's not likely. Oh, good. Lucky, listen, you need to tell me where you are, because... Hey, hey, I found your bracelet. You're kidding. Where? The docks. It looks like I was just sitting there waiting, waiting for me to come and get it. That is so great. Okay, Lucky, you need to tell me where you are, because I... Lucky? Hello? Are you there? Lucky! Give me that. Smooth move, Slick. 
I guess your pathetic old man taught you a thing or two after all, didn't he? Everything I know that has any value or substance, I didn't learn from you. You really missed me, didn't you? Are you crazy? No! You had me here! You had me tight in that pantry! All you had to do was get the keys to the car and walk out. Why didn't you? I had to make a phone call. It's a cell phone. You could have made it on the run. You could have made it from the car. No. You want to be here. Whether you realize it or not, like you want to be here. Okay, from everything you've told me, it doesn't sound like he's hurt or he's in trouble with the police. That's the good news. We've got to be grateful for that. My bad. Well, if Lucky decided to go somewhere, he would have at least called Liz to let her know. Mm -hmm. So I think it means he was taken against his will. Not a very comforting conclusion, is it? No. The question is, by whom? Could have been anyone. I'm not so sure about that. Lucky has incredible instincts for danger. And I think it would be pretty tough for the average run-of-the-mill mugger to sneak up on him. Well, what if, what if they had a gun and, and jumped him from behind or something? Uh, okay, look, I'm, I'm not eliminating that as a possibility. I, I just... I don't know. I have a gut feeling. I have a gut feeling that it was someone he knew. Well, you know, Lucky was partly responsible for, for putting Liz's rapist in jail. You think that that might be connected? Maybe so. Has, has that rapist been released? No. Then it could be friends of his or something like that. Yeah. Well, that would mean that you and, and Emily and Elizabeth would all need protection. Oh, my God. I'm going to call Jason. He might have some connections. He to help us out. I've never seen you like Remember. this before. Like what? You're so incisive and focused. I mean, most parents would be freaking out right now. I am. But I've had years of practice. And this is what a mother does when one of her kids is in trouble. Oh, I'll, I'll get it. Hey, hey, Nicholas. Hi, Mrs. Spencer. Hi. What's up? Have you heard from Lucky? Yeah, I have. Oh, thank God. He's with his father. Of course. 